good morning children today you will learn part 2 of unit 12 perimeter area and volume in this session you will learn concept of area and the formula to find area of rectangles and squares learning objectives to review the concept of area to develop the formula to find the area of rectangles and squares children in the previous class you have learnt about perimeter so let us recall what is perimeter perimeter is the distance around the edge of a figure to find perimeter we add the length of all the edges perimeter has the same unit as length and breadth have so today now we are going to learn what does the term area means area is the amount of surface a figure covers the area of a figure is the number of unit square that cover the surface of a closed figure so area is always measured in square units in short square units is written as sq dot units given alongside is a square of side 1 cm we say that the square has an area of 1 square centimeter different units of area a square with 1 centimeter sides is a square centimeter example small surfaces like the area of a book television study table and so on are measured in square centimeter a square with 1 meter sides is a square meter example large surfaces like the area of a park playground and plot are measured in square meter a square with 1 km sides is a square kilometer example very large surfaces like the area of a city and area of a country are measured in square kilometer here are some more examples where we use area for table cloth covering the wall with wallpaper covering the floor with tiles for carpeting the room covering a book painting the wall and so on or other example where in the area is computed we can find area by counting the number of squares let's find the area of the following figures by counting the number of squares let's take each square of side 1 cm question 1 here the figure is covering 1 square so area is 1 square cm question 2 This figure has 4 squares so area is 4 square centimeter. Question 3. Here the figure covers 9 squares so area is 9 square centimeter. Question number 4. Here it, this figure has 6 squares so area is equal to 6 square centimeter it is not easy to find the area of a larger surfaces just by counting the squares so now we will be learning the shortcut or a formula to find the area of a rectangles and area of a squares okay first let's find the shortcut or the formula for area of a rectangle let's see this example 
here in the rectangle a there are 24 squares so area by counting the squares is 24 squares centimeter now you can see in this figure here in rectangle a there are 8 squares along the length and 3 squares along the breadth or a width so 8 multiplied by 3 is the same area as we get by counting all the squares. Thus, area of a rectangle A is equal to 8 cm into 3 cm equal to 24 square cm. Example 2. Similarly, here in rectangle B, there are 3 squares along the length and 5 squares along the breadth. So, area of a rectangle B is equal to 3 cm into 5 cm equal to 15 square cm which is same as by counting the squares that is 15 square cm. Example 3 here there are in rectangle C there are 5 squares along the length and 4 squares along the breadth. Thus area of a rectangle C is equal to 5 cm into 4 cm equal to 20 square cm. From the above 3 examples we can see a relationship between the length, breadth and area of the rectangle. Thus, area of the rectangle is equal to length into breadth. In short, we can write A is equal to length into breadth. This is a shortcut or a formula to find the area of the larger rectangular surfaces whose area cannot be found by counting the number of squares. Ok, now let us do one example using this shortcut method or the formula method of the area of the rectangle. Ok, example 1. Find the area of a rectangular plot whose length is 35 meter and breadth is 20 meter use the shortcut or a formula here in the question the plot is of a rectangular shape and length is 35 meter and breadth is 20 meter so we have to use the shortcut or the formula of area of a rectangle that is length into breadth so the solution is Length of the plot is 35 meter. Breadth of the plot is 20 meter. Thus, area of the plot equal to length multiplied by breadth. That is 35 meter into 20 meter. That's equal to 700 square meter. So, area of the plot is 700 square meter. Now let's find the shortcut or the formula method to find the area of a square. A square is a special rectangle with equal length and breadth. Here in this figure, length is 5 cm and breadth is also 5 cm. So we can just say side is equal to 5 cm and it is a square. Therefore, area of a square by counting the squares is 25 square centimeter. It is same as 5 centimeter into 5 centimeter that is equal to 25 square centimeter. Thus, area of a square equal to side into side. This is called the shortcut or the formula to find the area of a square 
okay now let's do an example using the shortcut or the formula method of the area of a square find the area of a square of side 9 cm solution in the question side measurement is 9 cm thus area of a square equal to side into side that is 9 cm into 9 cm that will be equal to 81 square cm thus area of a square is 81 square cm now let's do the exercise exercise 12b page number 179 question number 1 Use the shortcut to find the area of these figures. Give your answer in square units. Question A. In this figure, length is equal to 4 units and breadth is equal to 2 units. Thus, area of a rectangle equal to length into breadth. That is 4 into 2. That is equal to 8 square units. question b here length is 3 units breadth is equal to 4 units thus area is equal to length into breadth that is equal to 3 into 4 that will be equal to 12 square units question 2 find the area of these shapes using the shortcut u your answer in square centimeter question a in this shape length is equal to 5 cm breadth is equal to 7 cm so the sh shape is rectangle thus area of a rectangle equal to length into breadth that will be equal to 5 multiplied by 7 that is 35 square cm thus the area of this shape is 35 square cm question b here in this shape length is 8 cm and breadth is also 8 cm so the shape is a square thus we can say the side is equal to 8 cm therefore the area of a square is equal to side into side that will be equal to 8 into 8 that is 64 square cm Okay now let's find length or a breadth when area is given Let's recall the formula area is equal to length into breadth therefore length is equal to area divided by breadth and breadth is equal to area divided by length Let's do some examples Question A Area is equal to 48 square cm length is equal to 4 cm find breadth so here we have to find breadth so we have to apply the formula breadth is equal to area divided by length that is 48 divided by 4 that will be equal to 12 cm thus breadth is equal to 12 cm question b area equal to 220 square cm breadth equal to 20 cm find length here we have to find length so we have to apply the formula length is equal to area divided by breadth that is 220 divided by 20 that will be equal to 11 cm thus length is equal to 11 cm Now children complete this assignment in your notebook exercise 12b page number 179 question number 1 a b c question 3 a b c and question 4 e f g and h thank you children